Uh, how's it going? So, this is kind of a different type of video for me than what I normally do, but I've been wanting to do a Let's Play for a very long time, and a lot of the games recommended to me I've played already, you know, I've played Witch's Heart, I've played Your Turn to Die, I've played Zero Escape, so, uh... I finally found one that I haven't played. I haven't even heard of this before. Uh, I stumbled upon it in the tag for something for some other game. And as with most things, how I discover them, I was like, ooh, this looks kind of spooky. And that's my entire motivation to play it, is I like spooky things. So I have no background knowledge. I know nothing. I know there's multiple episodes. So this is the first one. I did some research and I made sure I had the right one. Uh, and enough said, let's just, let's get into it. Okay, so there's no voice acting, so I guess I'll just read. <clears throat> My world met its end a long time ago. The humanity as I knew it has ceased to exist and disappeared without a single trace. The gods they believed in have died and churches were built as their graves. The chaos turned into order and it finally became quiet. All I can do is dream, for I am so, so tired. Before I abandon the words that form noise in my head, will you be so kind as to join me in dream seeing? Hello, Charlotte. Episode 1. Junk food, gods, and teddy bears. Hello, Charlotte. Ah. Um. What voice should I give her? Just kind of like a... It's nice to meet you. Please take care of me. This is my room. Uh. It's rather minimalistic. What a lackluster design. That one's kind of mean. I'm going to go with this one. Quite modern, don't you think? Let's go to the dining room. I'm hungry. Oh, I'm moving. I'm moving. Look at this single spot of blue. What? The current user has restricted access to the data Omnicube. Please input your inquiry. Screens. The screens store user data and monitor user activity. Absolute rules. Screens must not be turned off. Current user Charlotte is expected to follow the absolute rules implicitly. We are not responsible for bodily injury, including dismemberment, mental disturbances, or other harm to the user's well-being caused by infringement of the rules listed above. Okay. Cool. Okay, what is an Omnicube? Omnicubes, short for omnipotent cubes, are multitask devices that allow the transportation, duplication, creation, or disintegration of organic matter and the storage of data. Please do not put liquid soap inside Omnicubes, as it might cause unforeseen consequences to happen. Ah, uh, damn, there go my plans. Tenants. Please- oh no! <laughs> so much reading, okay. Current user who is yet to complete the educational program. That's Charlotte. Uh, okay, this is gonna take me a while. Please choose a category to read. Current user's observation notes. Aiden. Oh, he's kinda cute. Ground floor's butler, user note. Hobbies include sewing and taxidermy. Nah, he's not cute anymore. Uh, okay. Huxley. <laughs> what is that? A surgeon who owns an interdimensional clinic on the second floor. User note. Once ordered 30 boxes of duct tape for unknown purposes. Okay, he's my favorite. No! Oops. Okay. Uh, uh, I don't care. Instinct. Okay. Choose a category to read. Bennett. That's... <laughs> that's... That's... That's the Among Us guy. That's what that is. <laughs> oh no. I'm not gonna be able to take this seriously if that's the character design. Okay. Oh god. <laughs> I can't um, occupation and real name unknown. User note, Bennett is the name of the badge on his hazmat suit. Okay, can I go to sleep? I don't want to 
to sleep yet. Okay, I can't. Band-aids, scalpels, notes, tea bags. Everything is such a mess. Uh, whoa. Nope, I can't. What is this? User log might be useful. Do I want to hit that? Look out for puppeteer symbols. Only users with X in their names have access to all doors. Was that the guy with the mask? I think he had an X. I don't remember. Oh boy, teleport Omnicube. Current user has restricted access to the teleport Omnicube. TV room. Wait, I don't know if I want to go there. Oh no. Oh no, I'm lost. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. This is my room. Okay, so that's- This is a teleport thing. This is just gonna take me where I need to go, and this is, like, information. Okay. Uh... Uh, I found the- Well, I don't want to go there yet because that's where I'm supposed to be. You know how games work. You go everywhere you can't go first. I don't need to call anywhere right now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Access denied. How rude. Was it locked yesterday? Okay. I'ma go do some cooking. The last time I tried to cook something, the world was almost destroyed by the food monster. I wish Bennett didn't put his chemicals on the shelves along with the sugar and the salt. Oof. <laughs> Soap obtained. Not even our dining room drawers have anything edible. Some tableware inside. Some tableware inside. Lots of tableware here. Okay. Dear Charlotte, I'll be home late. Call 0800 XXXXXX to order food from Charlie's. XOXO Ma. This note is eight months old. My parents work on holidays. New task received. Order food. Okay, I saw a phone in the other room. I know what I'm doing. Who's over here? Bum, 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 bum. I lost a life from ordering. Hey, it's Charlie's Organic Junk Foods. Please place your order. Um, I'd like to order eco-friendly chicken nuggets and an insta-diabetes soda. Please. I shouldn't be so nervous when talking to a machine. Thank you for ordering at Charlie's. Stay healthiest with us. Oh, my food's here. I'm coming. That's... Is, a, is it this door? It was unlocked yesterday. Where's well, the front door? Is it just going to be in the dining room? Hello? Did I miss my food? Nothing out of bone side. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. This is a very boring house. Okay. Library? I'll put magic word. I don't know. Access denied, ill-mannered child. Oops. <laughs> I don't need to call anywhere right now. Did it tell me where to... Did I miss it? <laughs> it wasn't locked yet. That was the... D okay. Is there a password? I'll be home late. Order food. Puppet controls, four options. Oh. The puppet control menu has four options. Stuff, tasks, rewind points, exit. Junk is stuff we throw away. Stuff is junk we keep. Tasks, tasks, tasks are daily life quests. Rewind points contain saved data of previous events. NB should only should be used only if the puppet dies or the puppeteer must leave the control console. 
exit should not be an option for a responsible puppeteer. Look, I just want my chicken nuggets. User? Yes? Hello? Um... It just went black for a second, sorry. Basement, dissection room, tailoring room, test rooms. Ground floor, living rooms. Okay, I literally don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Is there a password somewhere? Yeah. How do I... This entire game is going to be me trying to figure out how the hell I open this door. The Nerd Lord. My fair salaryman. Astronaut Commando. This is Mother Shelf. She loves romance books. <laughs> My favorite romance book too. The Golden Apples of the Sun. Physics of the Impossible. One Hit Man. My Humble Bookshelf. Note obtained. Cool. How do I read it? Shelves are full of literature in an alien language. I can't read the titles. Sewing for everyone. Dressmaking made easy. Fancy folds. Art of napkin folding. Hayden's bookshelf. I find it cute. <laughs> oh, I know what voice he's getting. Anarchist cookbook. Now with more recipes. Kaboom. Advanced chemistry for explosives enthusiasts. Science fiction almanac. 24th edition. These are Bennett's shelves. They just scream danger. And geek. Hmm. I don't know what voice he's getting, however. God. Is there like a button that I can hit if I want to um open stuff? I don't want to accidentally close the game, but what? I'm literally just hitting random buttons. Sweet. Oh, 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 I figured it out. Stuff. Ah, back. The truth. Okay, okay. We did something. <laughs> the puppeteers. This guy. Known types. Seth type. Lilith type. Live in. True realm. Purpose. Control and direct. Assigned to humans only. Probably. NB. Can rewind time when the puppet dies. I don't know what this means. The observers. Ooh. Ooh, that's spooky. World government members wear animal skull masks. Known representatives, Umbrella Man. The puppets. Oh, that's me. Also known as humans. Live in false realm. Purpose to... Err... To err. <laughs> known representatives. Me. Mom. Dad. Classmates. Not so sure about the classmates. The aliens. Huxley. Pretend to be human to cause less ruckus. Live in the false realm. Known representatives. Huxley, Bennett, Aiden, politicians. Oh. No. The magic word is please. Oh, wait, 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 wait. wait. Is that for the door? Yeah. How <laughs> do I go back? Oh no. Okay. I don't know how to... <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, oh god. Help! Oh, okay. <laughs> I... I'm a little slow. Um... It's please? Okay. I'm a great puzzle solver. Let's a nice girl access granted. I'm in the hallway now. It's very, uh, very decorative. Nothing of interest in here or in there, apparently. No. Nope. Can I? Is this a. I can't. The ladder leads to the first floor. The ladder. Okay. This ladder leads to the basement. Gotta answer the door first. A strange hissing noise is coming from behind the door. Ugh. Want me to open it? Yes. Charlotte opens the door. There's a giant cockroach behind it. Oh, that's large. <laughs> make me jump. Why did that make me jump? Oh, look at his little hat. He's kind of cute. Charlie's healthy junk foods delivery. Uh, please sign here. Okie dokie. Gotta make my signature beautiful. Okay, same though. <laughs> Charlotte draws a large X on the paper. Nailed it. Well, thank you. Hope you enjoy the rest of your day. The delivery man hisses politely and leaves. What a nice bug. Obtained lucky meal. New task received. Feed Charlotte. I will sit at the table and I will eat this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's the. God, I already know what a poison's getting. <clears throat> what a mockery of real food. Is it all they can offer these days? <laughs> you should try wallpapers, dear child. They're especially rich in iron. <laughs> Don't listen to them. Soap is much better in nutrition. Uh, guys, do I get a say in this? Aliens don't really have a concept of personal space, do they? By the way, Mr. Aiden, the door to the ground floor corridor doesn't open. <laughs> it's closed for minor constructive construction works. Nothing to worry about. Hmm. If you come out at night, you might find something interesting there. Aiden pinches Bennett. Ow! Stop giving the child weird ideas. Don't listen to him, dear girl. If you want to join in, I'll be watching Soapna in the TV room. Soap operas are- soap operas just call for soap milkshakes. Bennett leaves. I almost forgot. Come to the dissection room later. I have a favor to ask of you. Hayden and Huxley leave too. I'm gonna cook again. <laughs> Just kidding. Uh, okay, I guess I gotta go talk to them. Let's go hang out with the Amanas guy first. Bennett is absorbed in watching TV. He's very, very interested in this heart. Great show. Can I can I watch with them? Yeah. Wow. I love this. Okay. Can't do anything there. It's just like porn. No, he's watching a soap. He's watching Days of Our Lives. What's two plus two? Four. Four, of course. You're free to make that statement. Then it is correct. You may pass. See, it's not five because this isn't 1980. <laughs> Literary reference. Ladder leads to the first floor. Ladder leads to the basement. Hmm, I forgot where I put the basement key. I gotta go find a key. Maybe it's in my room? Okay. E. <laughs> this background music is like, got these train whistles. And it's kind of making me laugh. Found the basement key. What did I lose? Okay, wait. You gotta save often. Otherwise, bad things will happen. Okay. Four. I wonder what would happen if I put five. 
Okay, unlock the door. Oh, I found something. Open me. Open the box. Sure, says to. Charlotte opens the box. Suddenly, everything collapses into a singularity. <laughs> womp womp. Sudden end. Destroyed the world in less than a second. Good thing I saved. Yes. Yes. We're trying again. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Wait, did I get the key in this save? I literally... Oh, I did. Okay. Okay. My memory is terrible sometimes. Okay. Four. I keep meaning to see what happens if I hit five. Am I gonna get a bad end if I hit five too? Because that would be hilarious. Okay. Open me. No. Yep, this seems fishy. Although I'm still curious. Sewing tools are stored inside. They're also stored inside this side. It's filled with fabric. <laughs> oh, those are dresses. I don't know what I thought those were, but <laughs> it made me laugh. Okay. Let's go here first. Ooh, actually, no. Let's go to the other room first. That's a dissection room. Okay. Hidden Love's Order. Eunice Mannequins are in place. Get another polka dot dress. Simple black and white dress. Polka dot dress. He, he, <laughs> he likes these polka dot dresses. Another polka dot dress. Aiden! Oh, this is a pretty dress. Stop. Stop making the same polka dot dress. It's not very attractive. This dress is prettier than the one next to it. Which is polka dot. So that makes sense. Oh, I just noticed he has like little antlers. Oh, and is that is this supposed to be him on like the wall behind him? Whatever. Hi, Mr. Aiden. B being a busybody as always? Hello, dear girl. There's a dress I want you to try on if you don't mind. I'd love to. I put the dress I put on the dress the tailor made. Wow! A CG. I feel like I've seen this guy somewhere before and I don't know where. Whoa! It's totally rad! It's called White Spotted Jellyfish Dress. It still needs a few finishing touches. I'll give it to you when it's ready. Wow. Well, this is not one of those stupid polka dot ones. This suck. My section room. I'm gonna read her books. The Selfish Gene. Bad Science. The man who mistook his wife for a hat. Yeah, I hate when that happens. Oh, finally some books I've read. Girl, what are you reading? Do-it-yourself heart massage. Everything you wanted to know about string theory, but feared to ask. Craving paper. Embrace your inner, inner Pika. Like Pikachu? The Almanac of Official History. Ooh. What to do if your daughter brings home uranium? That's important. Huxley's busy dissecting a corpse. Presumably it was human once. Hi, Dr. Huxley! Hello, little Charlotte. About the little talk we had earlier. Can you do me the favor of looking after my lovely nephew for a couple of days? I've been so busy working on a cure for the eye plague that I can't keep an eye on him at all. <sighs> for all I know, he could be collecting rare specimens in broad daylight right now. He's too passionate for his own good. I don't know if this voice is working. Whatever. Aren't you too passionate for your own good yourself? The main reason why I'm worried about him, however, is that he has no sense of direction. You see, he may have a bad attitude, but don't let it get to you. Okay, I'll help. Felix, come here. Ugh. I don't need anyone to look after me, Uncle Huxley. Right, right. Now, go play with your new big sister. Uncle has science to do. There he goes again. It's nice to meet you, Felix. I'm Charlotte. Hi. If you want to make it through the day, don't you dare invade my personal space. Whoa, I can almost feel his glare burning into my skin. This is going to be a long day. New locations are available. New task received. Kill time. Oh, he's gonna follow me. Oh, he's a little boy. Soap Bible. I need that. 
So your son is an alien, and how to raise your IQ by watching soap operas. I'm not sure about the usefulness of the second book. I'm gonna give him, like, because he's too similar to the Among Us looking guy right now. I'm gonna give him, like, the voice I give Sirius Gibson when I play Witch's Heart. Just kind of, I call it the unidentifiable accent. It's like a really bad British accent because I can't do one. <clears throat> if IQ stands for imbecility quot quotient, the title is rather accurate. Yeah, that suits him better. That's like my Sundari voice. <laughs> the Complete Guide to Conquering the Universe, 425th Failproof Edition. Cannibal Man, set free. That's about me. Human Encyclopedia, the Complete Edition. Clinical surgery for dummies. 1,000 human diseases to die from. Okay. Are human diseases deadly to you? Actually, no. We can develop symptoms similar to a human cold, though. Move aside. The door scans the boy's eye. Access granted. One door out of three leads to death. Spooky. Blech. Well, I hope you enjoy the Monty Hall room. Wait. Open the door and die. Survive and get a prize. Wow! Is it for real? I want to check. Two is my lucky number. Door two opens, nothing happens. Open another door. One. Door one opens, nothing happens. Got an applause. Hey, yes. The door and die. Ah! Nothing happens. Nothing happens. I got a ribbon. Very exciting. Ah, okay. Uh, three first. Bang. <laughs> I died. You know. I don't know what I was expecting. Okay. Open one, three. I got. I want the ribbon. Okay. Door one. Wow, this was a really exciting room. I probably should save. Okay, let's go in this room. I can open these. Access granted. Oh! <laughs> no, I'm kidding. That's, uh... That's... That thing from Witch's Heart. Um... If you played it, you know what I'm talking about. Oops, I skipped. What a uh, squishy! A specimen for research and an organ supply. Look, but do not touch. Okay, I'm assuming I'm gonna die if I touch it. Let's touch it. Damn it, I can't touch it. <laughs> Darn. I wanted to... Okay, let's go in this room. Wait here. <laughs> Oh god. Oh my god. This is why Bennett's crew works. Pretty much. Stuff usually blows up in here, so it has restricted access. Hello, cast of Among Us. <laughs> it's Franklin. Hello, Franklin. The name on this suit label is Blanche. Who are you? Oh, that's Blanche again. That's Franklin. Hello, oh, Florence. What's up? Florence, so it's a lady. <clears throat> We've discovered that adding dark matter to the dough improves the taste of a chocolate cake by 15%. Don't tell anyone. Okie dokie. His name appears to be Baldwin. It's Franklin. Love that guy. This guy has Archibald written on his suit label. He's probably really hot underneath. He's Goodwin. Hi, Goodwin. That's Lecter. That's a stupid name, Lecter. This person has no suit label. 
Okay, he's sus. It's Frank. I feel like there's multiple Franklins. Unless he's just moving around. Good win. Who are you? Stop, stop moving. You do not want that selector. You. Antoinette. Okay. Hello, Florence. Okay, that's Florence. Okie dokie, I wanna look at- I wanna look at your wall. Help. Stop. Use your log. Shh. They're watching. I have always considered the possibility of being watched. It is pretty plausible if we take into account all the conspiracy theories. Found ton terror, take it. No. Right, shoulda known. This one's a fake anyway. Yeah, I was gonna die if I took that. Nothing of interest here. Great. Can I leave now? Ugh, my back hurts. I gotta readjust my position. <sighs> okay. Huxley looks very busy. Still busy, Mr. Aiden? Hello, little Charlotte and Felix. Since you're here, would you mind trying on some clothing? What a pain. Charlotte covers Felix's mouth with her hand. Of course we do. Another polka dot dress. Hey, Felix! Look at this dress. Isn't it awful? Look at this. It's a polka dot dress. Yes, I hate it. See, this one is much prettier, because it doesn't have polka dots. Still busy. Hey, let's try on clothing. Uh, it doesn't look like there's anything left to do down here. Can we go upstairs yet? Nope. Oh, this is new. I wonder where this door leads to. You and your curiosity. Fine, I'll open it. It's outer space! Oh, we're in outer space! <laughs> Satisfied? Yep! Is it gonna kill me if I open this? Found something nice, take it. Better not. I learned my lesson. This door is locked. I don't want to disturb my neighbors. Where I came from. So it's locked. Okay. Let's go back to. I wonder where this door leads to. It's gone now. Maybe I should have taken it. <laughs> Let's make a phone call. Or not. Hey, Felix, do you want to see my room? This dude doing. And it looks sad. Hi, Bennett! Are you dead or something? After 1037 episodes and 10 specials, they finally confessed their undying love to each other. Underneath my protection suit, I'm dying from complicated feelings. Let's leave him until he's ready to return to harsh real the till the till he's ready to return to the harsh reality, shall we? I can go through the couch. Ooh. I really like that um, the TV is just like like a really big old timey TV. Is that the remote? Can I? Okay. Let's go back to my room. <laughs> Except I think Charlotte's like 10. Well, Big Sis is going to sleep. How about you? I do not require sleep. I'll grab a bottle of soap and measure your brainwaves while you sleep. Stupid human. Sounds like a plan. I suppose I don't have to accompany you to the bathroom? No way in hell. Go to sleep already. Good night. Oh, bye, Felix. Well, I'm off to bed. Good night. Good night, Seth. Something slimy crawls into the room. I gotta hide. Charlotte hides under the bedsheets. 
<laughs> oh, hey, Mad Cat. You scared my puppeteer here a little. One day, my cat turned into a maggot. Or he was a maggot all along that turned into a cat? No. The mad cat states as it makes itself comfortable on my bed. Good, good cat. Oh, that's kind of cute. Charlotte pets the mad cat. It purrs. Charlotte falls asleep peacefully. Cute. Whoa! Oh, God. That scared me. Oh, God. What was that sound? Felix promised to come back soon, too. Did he get lost in the house? How about we go look for him? I want the pepper spray. Flamethrower would be more effective, don't you think? I'm gonna save. Okay. Felix is not here. He's in here. Is this guy still watching TV? Bennett is snoring in his sleep. No, he's he's out. Felix is not here. What is the meaning of life? If only I knew. Oh. glass is missing. Go in? Not yet. I want to see what's over here. Door went. Okay. Now we go in. Yes. Felix couldn't have gone here, could he? Okay. <laughs> what is this place? I don't remember our house having a direct passage to a princess castle. It's, it's Yukiko's castle from Persona 4. It's too dark to see anything. Where did I just go? It's raining, it's pouring, the old bear's growling. Is there a bear in here? I wonder why there are bear toys everywhere. Apparently. But I can't see. I... Okay. It's... Ooh, it's raining. That's it? Oh, oh, I'm in here. I could, I didn't even see my person. I just left. Okay, this is just a little spooky. Can I go up here? I can't. I really don't like not being able to see anything. Take the lantern? Yes. Oh, there we go, there we go. You will find what you need upstairs. I hope I do. Ah. Crack of the wall. Oh, growl's coming from it. It's a bear. Ultimate guide to skinning and gutting. Hopian Homo sapiens cooking with passion. You. To my imagination, I didn't die as move. Human taxidermy. Human taxidermy. Me. Going wild. Hunting, human rights, and contested meaning of nature. Thyroid gland 101 festive recipes. That is... Yeah. Now this is creepy. Pull? Not yet. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's following me. <laughs> that end, little Teddy wants to play. Okay. That was something. Good thing I saved. Okay. Oh, I just I just can't touch this guy. Okay. I feel like I have to pull it eventually, though. I'm a little scared to right now. The door? What? Okay. I am very bad at surviving.
Okay, so we don't want to open the door. That book was a lie. Mm, it didn't do anything. These toys are kind of cute. Wonder why there are bear toys everywhere. Very nice, boring little bears growling. I did something. So I want to save. Uh, how do I escape that? <laughs> See, I'm thinking, this is my thought process right now, maybe I go get him shot by the door that killed me. <laughs> this is already 36 minutes. I don't know where to stop this. Do I just have to go fast and get him sh Hmm. Hmm. I don't know what I'm doing. <sighs> That's not good. Okay, okay. Just the yellow teddy bear. Nothing scary at all. Wait, what does this say? Rain, rain, go away. Little teddy wants to play. Do I have to like? I don't know what to do. <laughs> I'm thinking I just, I have to, I have to... I have to get him. Okay. Stop killing me, teddy bear. I should really keep a kill count for this. Okay, here we go again. I don't know what I'm doing. Here I go. He's so fast! Ah! I'm gonna be doing this for like literally an hour knowing myself. <laughs> okay. He only runs when I. Mm. So you have to get up there fast, I guess. Do I have any items? I don't think I needed to use that item yet. He's too fast! Oh my god. I, I've died from a teddy bear like seven times now. <laughs> it's great. It's gonna be so much fun editing all this out.
I'm looking this up. <laughs> I'm not the type to do this. But... Okay. This is going to take me a while. Okay. <sighs> this is so annoying. <laughs> I know what I have to do now, at least. I have to go to the other room and pull the other rope, apparently, which I honestly don't think I would have figured out by myself because I'm kind of dumb. Hmm. I'm saving. <laughs> sounds anymore. Let's enter. Yes. And now I'm in a kitchen. Let's cook. It's an oven. Got a backdoor key. It's an oven. Lots of ovens. It's an oven. It's a ladder. Uh, hello? Ooh, she's creepy. Hmm. <clears throat> the little girl's eyes well up with tears at the sight of Charlotte. Um, I'm very sorry. Can I help you somehow? Are you lost? Aren't you lost yourself, big sister? That hurt. Leave. Freya doesn't talk to strangers. Okay, Freya. Bitch. Okay, we got some stairs. We got painting of a flower. Midnight's bear cubs. Nothing of interest inside. Blah 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 blah. Bears and men. So this is like someone who loves bears lives here. That's what I'm got. That's what I'm gathering. <laughs> oh, little bunny. They're rabbit toys. Take one. Why'd you need another one? Hush, it's cute. I would take one personally, and I am a 22-year-old woman, so... <laughs> Attained rabbit toy. Good. Can I take both? Please? Aw. Nothing of interest. The bear factory. Build a bear workshop. The lovely honey. Do bears actually like honey? I've never met a bear myself. Oh, there's the creepy girl. It's locked. I can't do anything until I talk to you, I think. The girl's eyes light up at this- I don't want to give you my rabbit toy! That's mine! Huh? The girl's eyes light up at the sight of the rabbit toy. Want me to give it to you? I can have it. Sure! Here you go! Thank you. Your eyes look like egg whites. I'll take that as a compliment, I guess. I'm looking for a little boy. He must have lost his way in this place, too. Have you seen him by any chance? No. There's no one but Freya. I see. You must be very lonely. Freya is fun on her own anyway. Get lost already if you're not going to stay. An unlocking sound. Bye, Freya. Ooh, more toys. The bearer of the keys shall pass. These aren't alive, are they? The bearer of the ring shall pass. 
He's on to life, are they? Felix is just like, wherever he is, he's like, stop asking if they're alive. The bear room. Ooh. How there are any actual bears out there? I want to go in the bear room. Ooh. You're going to kill me? This toy looks like it can move any second. I see something shiny, though. Oh, hey, they have a 25th edition of the sci-fi. Hold on, can I take it, please? You can take it. High five for a fellow nerd. You high five with Charlotte. Ten sci-fi on that. That's still shining, though. It's... Nothing of interest here. Do I look like I'm scared of teddy bears now? Is a kid with a napkin. Okay, cool. He's gonna like. Hang on. <laughs> If I know games, he's gonna come and kill me as soon as I leave the room. Can we use something? Yup. <laughs> Knew it. Teddy's glare at me from the shelves. I don't... Mm. Can I use my almanac on him? I have gotten killed by this teddy bear so many times. The book of the bear, yes. Hey. Hey! Uh, okay. <laughs> oh, I'm smart. Phew, it worked. Never underestimate the power of words. Bye, book. And I need to save because... Take a break. Door is closed. <laughs> no breaks for you. Does this one also say take a break? Don't look in the mirror. I don't... I... Hmm. The cat room. If I get attacked by a kitty cat... Oh, it's just a little baby. Don't drink from the right cup. You're right or my right? Don't drink from the left cup. These flowers are pretty. Enter the right fireplace. Cats do not tell lies. These flowers are pretty. Things are dancing in the fireplace. <laughs> I just died. Okay. This game kills you a lot. I'm also freaking stupid. Don't drink from the right cup. I feel dizzy. I drink from the cup already. We're gonna just hang on. I have an idea. No. What if I go in the other fireplace? I'm so bad at puzzle games. The fire embraces me.
this is like this is gonna be an hour long video of me just dying. <laughs> Oh, hey! I got the ring! Okay, there we go. Thank you, kitty cats, for not killing me. Don't look in the mirror. The door. Let's see. Okay, we unlock the door. The curtains are heavy. Once upon a time, there lived three bears a little, a small, a wee bear. Oh god, a little, small, wee bear. A middle sized bear. And a great, huge bear. Goldilocks. On the chair. Oh, right. Found a silver key. If I know anything about fairy tales. Oh god. I know how the three bears story ended. What about you? The bears killed the intruder, the intruder left through the window, the intruder killed the bears. Yes, but we're not in a fairy tale. She would have been a good girl. She would have waited for the bears to invite her into the house. For they were good bears. But she was a rude, bad, bad little girl. Yeah. Now I have to look for an exit. I didn't really explore because I was scared of dying. Ah, oh, this again. That's wrong. The default clock sound. Who even uses that anymore? Please, let's leave this horrible place as soon as we find Felix. No. Yeah, better not. There's still butterflies in my stomach after that tea blend in the cat room. The porridge bowl makes me kind of hungry. Eat it. No. Thanks. There's no way I'm eating this. The small porridge bowl makes me kind of hungry. Eat it. No. Right. Don't make me eating anything in sight, will you? Open the curtains. Go on this side too. Don't look in the mirror. That's what it said. Turn on. Gone with the honey to kill a rabbit. The bear, little polar bear, Paddington bear. Oh, that guy's cute. Gone with the honey. I. Belly of the bears, hibernate and grow rich. The girl with the bear tattoo. The Lord of the Bears. <laughs> the Bear, the Witch, and the Wardrobe. Bear in Peace. Rupert Bear. Winnie the Pooh. Life and Times of Grizzly Adams. Rupert Bear. Okay. I'm gonna save. Because this. I think I'm gonna dive out in the mirror. Something unlocked. The window seems open from the other side. Only forward. Oh, okay. Can't do that. <laughs> I'm just looking for a good place to stop right now. <laughs> I've been kind of recording for a while. <laughs> okay. Mm. As soon as we find Felix, I guess. My question is, what unlocked? This mirror shows the future. Whoa, this feels photoshopped. Ugh. Her 
presents are lined up nicely. The bears seem to love symmetry. I don't really want to go back in this room because it. I'm scared that guy will come for me again. This toy is a movie. Oh. I couldn't see. That was hard to see. Okay. There's nothing in here. Or is there? Eee. There's something in here. Oh, God. There you are, little burglar. Choose the room you will await. Your punishment in lion room, torture room, oxygen room. Um, I don't know. This day can't get any worse, right? Oh. So by torture him, they didn't mean that I'd be tortured there. Team doesn't look any different from the others, though. Wait, I want to know what the lion room is. I was kind of thinking this is the one that would get me the bad end, so I could see them all. Wow. Error. What's wrong, Seth? I'm having problems with the program. Does that mean I can do what I want? No, I simply can't access rewind menu. Well, that's too bad. Seems like I can go in. Okay. Felix? You? I'm gonna hug him. He's my little buddy. I found you! Don't worry, Big Sis is here to help. G can't breathe. Stop this irrational display of affection this instant. So let's look aside. How did you get here? I, uh, got lost in your house. There's no way I'm buying that. Anyway, we need a plan. I'm not gonna sit around and wait until the bears use us for crappy taxidermy. The bears? What are you talking about? Aren't you captured by them, too? Excuse me? I just got here and I have no clue what you were talking about. Anyhow, you really didn't have followed. Do you even have any weapons on you at all? Only books. Seth is against violence. Please excuse me while I slam my hand against my forehead. <sighs> Good thing we met up before you could get into more trouble. Fine, fine, I get it. Sorry for being a burden. Well, there is nothing we can do about it now. Still, what are you really doing here? Well, there's a high probability of an oracle who is taking physical form appearing in this dimension. Such an occurrence happens once in several millenniums. An oracle? What's that? For you, they are equal to gods. In short, they are entities capable of creating small universes. I won't go into details for now. It's not like your puny brain will comprehend it all. They sound like fun. Okay. Oh, okay. He's back in my party. So this seems like a good place to stop for now. Um, let me know if you guys want more of this. It's kind of fun. I'm interested. 
I kind of want to know why these bears are trying to kill me. I like bears normally. They're cute. But these bears are bad. <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, if you do like this, leave a comment down below. And I'll do a part two as soon as I can. Thank you so much for watching.